But is the lack of information and interviews actually working? Look at this. New York Times swing state poll over the weekend showed Harris leading in three of the crucial battleground states. We begin tonight with the congressman, Republican from one of those states. You see there in the middle, Pennsylvania, Dan Muser. Congressman, thanks for being with us here on the Hill. Brand new studio, new show, new day. You start us off, and we appreciate it, sir. Um, trumpet shows down in your home state. Is he in trouble there? Oh, no, Blake. Seriously, not at all. We've got uh, not at major all? troubles. Not at all. Not at all. We First of all, our registration, uh, because largely of Donald Trump, but also the unbelievable level of Biden buyer remorse. And as Jean Pierre said today, the sp his spokesperson, there's no daylight, and I quote, between Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. But President Trump, uh, our registration's way up, the enthusiasm's way up, certainly the fundraising there, his ads are good. Look, Kamala Harris has proven herself to be the most ineffective vice president anybody could imagine. She then engaged in a cover-up of Joe Biden. So there's a trust factor, right? She bullied him out of office along with Barack Obama, so the story goes. Now they're engaged in a big makeover on her. She's reversing all of her policies, so including she was never the border czar. She's now for fracking. Were you lying so why then, is she Vice President, and you're lying now? Which, which is it? Why is she surging then? So... <laughs> Well, you know what? Because of the, what I just said, the makeovers that are taking place, the unbelievable positive press, and by the way, she has not yet engaged in what I think will be a, a, a Biden uh, uh, debate debacle uh, the moment she gives a, a speech. Look, we got 85 days, as you mentioned. The truth's going to come out. Actually, it's shorter than that because we've got uh, early voting going to take place. And we want yeah, the truth. Yeah, a month or so. Trump is about, yeah, um, Trump, is, Trump is no phony. Right? Anybody could say anything they want about him. The last thing you're ever going to call is, is Donald Trump a phony. And you know what? So the Harris Waltz ticket, complete con job, complete phony. The truth will come out. Let me let me talk to you. Uh, let me show you a headline in the Hill. GOP pleads with Trump to control impulse, impulses, focus on policy. Here was a, a post that Donald Trump uh, gave today, Congressman. He said, are you better off now than you were when I was president? Our economy is shattered. Our border has been erased. We're a nation in decline. Make the American dream affordable again. Make America safe again. Are you um, one of those folks in the GOP that would just wish he would deliver that message and say nothing else? Well, look, he wears his personality and his uh, attitude on his sleeve. He gets frustrated. He's on in, in the press a lot. Uh, we, will, we are going to crush in the policy debate, right, on the border, on energy, on inflation, on um, the, uh, her wanting to ban private, ins private insurance, on mandatory buyback on, on firearms, which she said many times, of course, she's reversing everything. She just tried. Her first policy pitch was plagiarizing President Trump's no, no taxes on tips. I mean, this is a sad uh, ticket that they have. And we need to expose it for what it what it is. Congressman, real quick, uh, why do you think he's talking to Elon Musk tonight? That's a good question. I, I think Elon Musk is a guy that um, is willing to spend, even waste his money on getting the truth out. Uh, uh, Donald Trump, I understand, just went back on X, formerly Twitter. I think he feels that the man, meaning Musk, is interested in getting to the truth. And uh, as I said, President Trump wears his... Uh, his policy, his personality, every, he's the same person behind right. the scenes as he is in front of the scenes, and I think he thinks it'll be a good, honest uh, interview. Congressman Dan Muser from the state of Pennsylvania, crucial swing state. Thanks for being with us here on The Hill. Appreciate it, sir. Thanks, Blank. I appreciate it, too. You Thank you for watching, and make sure you go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.